Hello, guys. Welcome to Ghost Story Actions. Once again, thank you so much for always liking, sharing, subscribing, telling your friends about what we do right there at Ghost TV. Big Lala, showstopper. You know, we get too much. Money. Let me say it in the the network. Big Lala. Just, you just they move too much. They disturb the <laughs> network. Oh, my days. Anyways, uh, thank you so much, Lala, for coming on the show today. Um, it's good to have you here. Um, how how is your how is your hand? How is your hand? <laughs> my, my hand is fine. Yeah. How is your own hand too? Are you okay over there? Yeah, well, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. We did we did almost this country don't tie up a scene. Buari, you know. Yeah, but anyways, welcome to the show. Um Whiskey um got on the billboard hot 100 uh you know for the first time some years ago with uh, one dance mm-hmm. you know by uh drake uh featuring whiskey and a lot of people actually celebrated that one lala you i think you did as well at that time of course everybody celebrated it was such a big deal big deal. something that we hadn't achieved and it wasn't it was still like a long time ago uh yeah. with the effort of um drake yeah yeah, yeah, yeah so with it, it, it was it was it was a big deal for people back mm-hmm. then, including mm-hmm. us. So yeah, and, and then within the last year, yeah, it's been much of a bigger, bigger deal. Egg, exactly, so exactly. And of mm-hmm. course, uh, you know, the years to follow whiskey as well, essence, you know, with uh Thames uh, then mm-hmm. essence, you know, mm-hmm. with uh Justin Bieber as well, getting to as high as number nine on the spot. Number nine on the Billboard Hot One, like it got into the top ten. That's a big one. CK yeah. also got in, you know, um, as well. Fireboy DML also got in with Ed Sheeran, you know, as mm-hmm. well. And of course, quite a lot of people, you know, uh, are already reporting the news right now about Buju and uh, you know, all Benson and Fields, you know, with that one, uh, you know, finesse, you know, the most Shazam song in the world, um, and of course, uh, you know, getting into the Apple Music World, you know, charts as well. That's one, you know, that one finesse. And, uh, you know, it's been, you know, it's been predicted it's going to get into the, you know, Billboard Hot 100 uh, this uh, particular, you know, week. But, Big Lala, that is the news. But you know that for every news that has Whiskey revolving around it, Whiskey FC are going to come up with their own narrative. Now, the narrative right now is every artist appearing on the Billboard Hot 100, making it seem like it's an easy fit and everything, should all be grateful for the person that paved the way. Now, we are back to that matter of paving way, way paver, way creator, way this, way maker. <laughs> now, now everyone is saying, be grateful, <laughs> be grateful to Whiskey because uh, he paved the way for the Hot 100, you know, for Nigerian artists. If not him doing it in 2016 with Drake and of course doing it with Essence and you know yeah I think that's about it Essence and uh, the, it would not have been possible. Did Whiskey really pave the way? Does he deserve to be worshipped? I say, Lord Whiskey, thank you for paving the way on the hot hundred. Well, <clears throat> I think the way I see it, um, with I would I won't use the word paved the way. I think we definitely did inspire a lot of these artists. Mm. Um, showed showed people a lot of possibilities. Yeah. Um, of of the reach their music can get to. Um, when you say someone paved the way, you say you showed them how it's done. And I don't I don't think we has showed people how it's done. And a lot of people would get this confused. I don't think he has showed people how it's done. I think he has showed that something can be achieved, can be done. Um, uh, something can be done and inspire other people. Yes, that that would be the right word to to to, to, uh, to use. Inspired. If you say someone has paved the way, that means they have shown you the way. They've taught mm. you how to fish. Mm. But quite frankly, um, um, he inspired and he brought a lot of attention to music uh, mm. in this part of the world. Yeah. But there are several tools, several. Uh, platforms that has made a lot of people um, get here by either by chance mm. or um, maybe by some sort of extra planning by an external force. The way Wiz got to his, I mean, Wiz 
obviously showed that you can get on the Billboard 100 with a massive feature like Drake, right? They also yeah. showed that you can get there by yourself uh, if your song goes viral in the US via Essence, right? Yeah. He's done that. But what um, CK has shown, see, of course, CK was, uh, was inspired. And we can also see that, we can also see that uh, Wiz also put a lot of attention on African music as a whole. Because yeah. if, if, if Wiz was not being successful, it was not hitting this target, People like uh, one, I won't see a CK and be like, mm-hmm. let's, let's invest in this guy and let's try and push him and get him up to the highest of heights mm. uh, across the world, right? Mm. And they spotlighted Love Entity and did all that. Credit like that, yes, you can give Whiskey because he inspired, he showed people's, I mean, he, he made people uh, see the value in the African mm. uh, space. I don't see that as paving the way. He hasn't mm. shown them how to get in there. I don't think there's even a one way. Nobody has even showed you a one way of how you're going to get there. Into... Well, anything... Lala, there's a video. Yeah. But Lala, there's mm-hmm. a video. Sorry. There's a video, you know, of Whiskey actually speaking to an Apple Music, uh, you know, lady at yes. the time. Mm-hmm. But of course, mm-hmm. another video as well, speaking Whiskey in another international interview, talking yeah. about how, you know, uh, he just wants to inspire people. He wants to show them how, you know, uh, exactly. that it's possible. Mm-hmm. You know, there's still so many more. He said he doesn't think you get that what he's done, you know, is the highest for Afro Beach. There are still a lot more people coming onto the scene and they're going yeah. to do way more than him and everything. Mm-hmm. But a lot of whiskey fans are misinterpreting that for actually paving the way. Well, see, is is most of these phrases they they're similar. I mean, it depends on how people want to look at it. I see it as ways inspiring a lot of people. Mm. But if I if I pave the way for you, that means I've shown you. Oh, this is the way. Mm. This is how you're going to go through the way. This is how you're going to navigate through the way. But people are navigating this differently. If Buju and Fields, sorry, let me rephrase. If Fields and Buju mm. are going to make Billboard Hot 100 tomorrow, right? Mm. It will not be the same way. Uh, it will not be the same way we made Top 100. Mm. If the, the, the two times he's made it. Or, yeah. or the, the three times he's made it, right? Mm. It will not be the same way CK has made the Billboard 100. It will not yeah. be the same way Fireboy has made the Billboard 100. Yeah. Because is there any serious backing with Fields hmm. that is pushing this song out there? The song was, is, I mean, the song is a phenomenal before it was released, right? Yeah. It got created, a part of it got on TikTok and it went viral, right? When something goes viral on TikTok, it affects every other place, right? Yeah, it goes viral yeah. on TikTok and Twitter. It yeah. affected the Shazam, number one most Shazam song in the world, right? That means a lot of people have actually noticed. Mm-hmm. Later on, you will now see that some of these other big platforms are now coming close and being like, oh, we have some value to offer Fuse and Buju. That's how it works. But the, rand- the, random- the randomness of the Afrobeat industry has happened again. That's what it is. Uh, this, I would say, is completely random because it got viral. It got big, and now we're seeing results. And don't forget, somebody had to come from Lagos all the way to O2 to come and perform that song. Do you know how many people watched that one minute performance of Fuse and be like, what is this song that these people are? Oh, I think I've seen this in a TikTok before. Uh-huh, Let me go and uh-huh, listen uh-huh, to it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You get. So it all, it all works together. And none of these happened the way, um, I mean, CK Essence. was close. In, uh, Essence did not happen like that. Uh, no, Essence yeah. had his own. He had his own pathway to becoming pathway, yeah. a, a smash hit in the US and getting to the top 10. Fireboy had his own pathway with Ed Sheeran because Ed Sheeran, a, a billboard monster. A was big, a, nah, yeah, yeah, he's a big board monster. <laughs> Essence did his own thing. For Essence to now get right to the very top, he had his own pathway of featuring a Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber, yeah. yeah. Fine. Um, people can say, okay, yes, you shouldn't. But yeah, I think it's it's, it's all good. Any, any way people want to interpret it, it's mm. inspiring that Wiz himself has called this. He himself mm. has said, so whatever he's doing is just, it's, it's child's race yeah. what others will yeah. achieve. Yeah. He's just being made look like he's a prophet because it looks like he has seen the future. <laughs> and now, if Fuse and Buju tomorrow will make me 100, it's going to be another massive, it's showing other people another route. Oh, yeah to get to the top. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, but um, how do you explain, how do you explain this to a 
normal whiskey fan, the, a random whiskey fan, that guy, this is not a case of paving the way, but inspiring. Well, no, like I said, there's, there's similarities, but and people can interpret it the way they want. They want their... I, don't, I don't actually have a problem with anybody who comes and says, oh, we've paved the way. No problem. If any, another person can come tomorrow and say, oh, but our boy paved the way. Or for people in the Grammy or something like that. Oh, <laughs> so someone mm. else come and say, David, don't pay the way for me. I've got no problem with it. <laughs> everyone, everyone, can, anyone can say what they like. So, I mean, at the end of the day, it's personal opinion, which is fine. Definitely. Uh, but, you know, for so many of them, you know, whiskey paving the way, you know, uh, for the big ones. Whiskey does always be, one's always be tough for FC Shan. I, I mean, would you and this thing does something they you know they want to go back and check it always be the number one to, i mean you know, sometimes like this can random definitely definitely they have points they have points mm-hmm. mm-hmm. it's, it's okay fc we, we are <laughs> <laughs> anyways guys let's have your thoughts on this one would you and uh, no feels and would you definitely you know with that one finesse getting into the top 100 uh, billboard you know this week it predicted that way but yeah, a lot of uh, people have been celebrating that one. And a whole lot more are talking about Whiskey actually paving, you know, the way for the new set of Afrobeat guys getting into the top 100 likes of CK, Fireboy, and of course, uh, you know, Buju and, uh, you know, Fuse. Uh, oh, you have to rephrase. That song is Fuse? Fuse and Buju. Fuse and Buju. Oh, sure. Fuse and Buju. Fuse and Buju, definitely. And I like the way Fuse is owning the song like guys, must only do even I will feel part they the blue for the song. Let me say the right time. Yeah, oh, I beg it is, give, it is give, my song. <laughs> definitely, definitely. Let's have your thoughts. Did whiskey actually pave the way or not? What exactly does way paving mean? What does it mean to inspire? What does it mean to pave the way? Big Lala is saying, well, there could be you know a bit similar, but yeah, similarities very much there. But Big Lala is saying it is inspire, not pave the way. Let us know what you think. Did whiskey pave the way or inspired? Or you think same non in good way? Let's have your thoughts. Put them down below. And of course, we'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for um, staying with us. Thank you for having uh, thank you for having me, Big Lala. Thank you for having me. You know. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Stay safe. God bless. Peace.